today we are going to discuss about activation energy of thermistor and its order code is 36300 so in this video we are going to discuss about the working of this trainer kit so this is the activation energy of thermistor trainer kit so here we are having the ic regulated power supply of 1 volt 2 volt and 5 volt at 10 milliampere and this is the pot which you can rotate for adjusting it to 1 volt 2 volt or 5 volt then this is the current meter which measures from 0 to 2 milliampere then this is the thermistor lead connector and this is the thermistor and this is the oven and here we will connect the thermometer and this is the oven on off switch now we are going to perform an experiment on this trainer so the experiment we are going to perform is to determine the activation energy of a thermistor and to determine the material constant of the thermistor material so firstly we will connect the thermometer so we will connect this thermometer like this so we have to keep the mercury point inside this hole like this and we have to hold the thermometer by using this stand now we will do the patch codes connection so for that firstly we need to connect the ground with the thermistor lead and we will connect the positive of the ic regulated power supply to the positive of current meter and then we will connect the negative of current meter to the thermistor end like this so that is how the connection is done now we will connect the thermistor lead so we will connect this thermistor lead at this connecting points like this so that is how the connection is done so now after the connection is done now we will keep the ic regulated power supply first at 1 volt and we have to make sure the oven switch at off position before giving the power supply to this trainer kit so now we have kept the oven switch at off position and we have kept the ic regulated power supply at 1 volt first now we will switch on the main unit and here on the current meter we will get the readings in milliampere so currently we are getting 0.033 milliampere and now we have to keep the oven switch at on so that the temperature rises so we have to note the temperature on the thermometer so on the thermometer here you will find the scale so you have to keep an eye over the scale we have to off the oven at a temperature of 80 degree celsius so till that we have to wait until the temperature reaches to 80 degree celsius and here you will see the increment in the current reading so right now it is 0.06 milliampere so after the temperature reaches to certain level of 80 degree celsius we have to keep the oven switch at off position and now the observation table is given in the manual so for 1 volt we have to take the readings from 80 degree celsius and in the temperature gap of 5 degree celsius we have to take the readings so now as the temperature reaches to 80 degree celsius we have kept the oven at off position and now after the reduction of 5 degree celsius temperature drop we have to take the readings from the current meter so the first reading we have to take it at 80 degree celsius and then the 5 degree celsius temperature drop will be there then we have to take the current reading so at 80 degree celsius we are getting the current reading of approx 0.05 milliampere then again the second reading will be taken at 75 degree celsius and then we have to put 
द रीडिंग्स इन द करेंट सेक्शन एंड देन वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट द टेम्परेचर टी बाय यूजिंग दिस फॉर्मूला देन रेजिस्टेंस देन लॉग आर एंड देन वी हैव टू प्लॉट दिस ग्राफ सो दिस इज द स्लोप यू विल गेट आफ्टर प्लॉटिंग द रीडिंग्स and similarly you can do it for 2 volt and 5 volt also so that is how the temperature reduces and we have to take the current reading and now i will show you how you can take the readings at 2 volt and 5 volt the process is same so now i have kept the voltage supply at 2 volt so now i have kept the ic regulated power supply at 2 volt and when we will keep the oven switch at on position then again we have to wait until it reaches to 80 degree celsius and then with the 5 degree celsius temperature drop we have to take the readings similarly we have to do it for 5 volt and then we have to form the observation table and we have to plot the graph and there we will find the slope like this so that is how you can perform the experiment using this activation energy of thermistor trainer kit so that's all the demonstration from my side if you have any query related to this trainer kit you can contact the tesca global website you can find the link in the description for more information go through the manual thank you for watching this video if you like this video like share and subscribe to our channel